We begin tonight with breaking news. The search continues for two teenage boys in the Schuylkill River. One had trouble swimming. His friend went in to help him and they did not resurface. First responders have been searching for about three hours now in southwest Philly. Let's get right to Alexandria Hoff on what she's learned from investigators about the search for these teens. Alex. Well, Jessica family out here, they're holding on to hope right now, and police are calling this a very active rescue mission. What we do know is that three teens were out to spending the evening on the pier here at Bartram's Park. It's in southwest Philadelphia. When around 7 o'clock, one of the young men entered into the water, which is the Schuylkill River. Now, another young man who has been identified by his grandmother, who we just spoke to as Quadir Beverly, 15 years old, jumped in to assist the other teen who was 14. Now, the one friend was watching all of this, and his two friends have not been seen since. Police are fearing that perhaps these young men were swept downriver. This current can be very, very strong. But again, this is still a very active rescue mission, as police are calling it. Let's take a listen right now to what Inspector Ray Evers had to say a short time ago. Three boys were um, near the river. Uh, from the information we got from the one individual witness is one of the young boys jumped into the river, had some difficulty swimming. Uh, the second boy jumped in to help his friend. Um, and the third boy witness saw both individuals, both young boys, go into the water. Uh, right now, we have a very, very active rescue mission with the Philadelphia Police Department and the Philadelphia Fire Department. Uh, we had the Marine unit, we had the helicopter in the air, we had canine. All the resources are being used right now to find these boys. Yeah, these resources still have a heavy presence out here, and rightfully so. The search for these two young men is still very active right now. And Quadir Beverly, he is the young man we were talking about, who we just spoke to his grandmother. She says she wouldn't be surprised that he took such an act of bravery in jumping in to try to help his friend who is struggling to swim in the currents of the Schuylkill River right now. They are holding on to hope. We actually got a picture of this young man. They are hoping that if they did go downstream at all and maybe were able to make it to some grassy area, that someone might be able to help identify them. But right now, this situation's been going on for about three hours. We are hoping a resolution and a happy one will be found soon. Family members, as I mentioned, still out here holding on to hope. We are reporting live in southwest Philadelphia. Jessica, I'll send it back to you for now. All right, Alex, we'll check back in with you shortly, thinking positively for those teens. Thank you.